Am I not recording? <laughs> We're going up Birmingham Library to, to uh, the Brum and Beyond exhibition for our media course. We're here now at the, the Birmingham Library, we're about to watch our first film, The Firm. Uh, we've just finished watching the first film, The Firm, which showed a positive and negative representation of Brummies. The positive being that the main character didn't uh, go mad when uh, at his rivals when they ruined his car, and he was calm and collective about his about 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 the situation. The negative representation is though that they seem like hooligans who are just out to cause trouble and violence to other people. They're all drinking and uh, swearing at everyone, and uh, they showed a negative representation against uh, women as they were uh, seeing them as objects and which is a negative representation uh, <laughs> and we're about to watch our next film the next clip we're watching is Anita and me Uh, the next film we watched is called Anita and Me, and it showed a very neg a negative representation of Brummies in their accent. Their accent made them sound a lot stupid and a bit thick, but which is a negative representation because not all Brummies are thick or uh, stupid. There was a positive representation because there was uh, a lot of multinational, multicultural in the, the area, which showed that. Birmingham is a multicultural society, and uh, everyone is everyone was shown to be friends, and they were talking and or helping each other, which is very positive. Uh, however, the, the main character, the kid, uh, the kid in Anita in the story, she was had a lot of pressure off her from her family to do well because they were successful, which shows that maybe the area that they've moved to is uh, not helping them as much as it should have which is a negative representation. shown very positively and a really nice place to live compared and uh, the, the voiceover had a voiceover man had a very clear and uh, clear accent clear accent clear voice compared to the firm which they had a very strong accent so it was harder to tell um, the, the women in uh, the women and children were, were in the nurseries which is represented as and 
uh, a feminine job, whereas the men were in a steel mine or in a factory, which was a masculine job in this time, which has changed over the years and will be different in different um, films in Birmingham. Uh, the last film we watched was uh, Gangsters, and it had a very negative representation as it shown that um, people from Birmingham are gangsters and up to no good, and violence and just up to no good. Uh, but there was a positive representation as they were well dressed and um, seemed like they knew what they were doing in, the, in life, even though they had a negative job. Uh, the accent was quite strong with some of some of the characters and made that but didn't make didn't make them sound stupid it made them sound more their, their accent wasn't as strong so it didn't sound, make them sound as stupid as other of the other films I've shown um, that there was a lot of multicultural as well in the film and which is positive because it shows that Birmingham is a multicultural society and uh, as a uh, and everyone is together as one which is a positive representation of Brummies which was shown in Gangsters. Uh, from watching all four of the films that we watched at the uh, library in Birmingham, The Firm, The Midlands Journey, Anita and Me and Gangsters, I can use some of what I've learned today in my own film, such as maybe using characters with less stronger accents in Birmingham maybe, or if I want to show that they've got a stronger accent, I will. Um, or the locations, the locations were very realistic which I really liked in all the films so I, I will use that in my, my own film definitely and um, I'll probably, won't you, there was a lot of violence and, and uh, up to no good in some of the films like The Firm and uh, Gangsters which I probably won't use in my film because I think I will show a negative representation of Brummies which I don't want to show, I want to show a more positive representation because I feel that the media um, does make Brummies sound a bit stupid or thick or something like that which I don't think is true. I think I want to show, use my film to show that we are not what the media represents us as. So these, the, the whole experience of the going to the library to watch these pretty br films from Birmingham has really helped me in my own production which I'm going to use. So I'm very grateful for this experience.